For some, it is their first car that really matters. That newfound feeling of freedom and independence. To go anywhere with friends on a whim. Then the second car beckons. An upgrade is looked for and the beginnings of pride in a car begin to seep in. The third car, however, is where it all begins. At least for me, anyway. I searched online for ages to find that perfect vehicle. Looking on all the sites. My name's James and I drive a 1993 Mercedes E220 Coupe. I grew up around cars. My dad's always had interest in vehicles. My earliest memories are always centered around traveling around in an old car. It shaped my life in every possible way. This Mercedes W124 Coupe is my first auto, my first Mercedes, and the first time I've experienced the power of classic car ownership. Everyone always comments on the interior. It's so well put together. Many argue the W124 is the last of the greats, and I can't blame them. It had a tremendously aerodynamic body and has aged like a fine wine. Its lines are timeless. This third car is the one that gives you an appreciation of driving, not hurrying the journey, but enjoying the ride. And as is life, history often repeats itself. Many years ago, my dad's third car was a Mercedes W114 280 Coupe. It had a similar effect. Is it just a coincidence? It's hard to say. He still has a W114 Coupe. It's not the same one, in fact, it's his third. So whilst it's the first car that kickstarts our driving futures, it's the third car that steals our hearts.